work about 11, 12 hours a day. We don't, most of the time we're here, we can be doing other stuff. I always went to art school, kind of always drew, did a little bit of graffiti on the side, and you know, kind of from there, it's one thing to do. Having tattoos, well, you're not in the industry, it's, you still get discriminated, because you don't have a certain look, and you know, people want that, uh, especially on restaurant stores, they still see it as uh, something like from the streets, so you've been in jail, and having this body modifications, it's more, like, uh, it, they see it as wrong, you know? So when you go ask for a job, it's like, you have tattoos, you can't really work, or you gotta hide them. Oh, uh, well, people that want to get tattooed, they gotta do research on their tattoo artists and what they wanna get tattoos. Because if you get an impulse tattoo, if you get something big, you're gonna regret it later. So make sure you like it, you know, make sure you your tattoo is exactly what you want. Uh, some of them are culturally wise, you know, my culture. Other ones are more like, uh, you know, just because I like them. There's no yeah. actual meaning. You gotta take care of them after you get out of the shop. You know, your tattoos are, it's, it's their own wound, so you gotta basically treat them as an open wound and not go into pools or get dirt on them. because they want bigger business, I think. These Harlem itself, it's the rates and rents are going up and gentrifications are over the roof now. It's harder, it keeps getting harder, yes.